2008 qualifier between France and Georgia was to be played at the newly renovated Boris Paikhadze National Stadium in Tbilisi. Georgia team manager Klaus Topmöller warned World Cup finalist France not to underestimate his team in the important Group B match. Shortly after taking charge of Georgia, the German coach said his main goal was for his team from the former Soviet Republic to qualify for its first major championship. Levan Kobiashvili, standing in as captain for the injured Kaka Kaladze, said that France was without any doubt the favourite, but his team was out to prove that it was an effective and united squad capable of performing at the highest level. At the opening of the refurbished stadium, a helicopter dropped footballs onto the newly laid surface, and hundreds of children were only too happy to join the celebrations. Georgian President Mikhail Saakashvili made a speech calling for national unity, though he didn't refer to the upcoming match. Georgia was drawn in Group B, along with France, the Ukraine, Scotland, Lithuania, the Faroe Islands and world champions Italy. For Georgia, the Euro 2008 qualifying campaign will be its toughest football test since making its international debut 13 years ago. First Group E game was the main item of interest. At the pre-match press conference, McLaren said that although Andorra was not one of the best teams in the world, England would still approach them with the same respect they showed toward Greece.